Hello guys and welcome back to Leeds and the Big Sam Challenge with the 0304 database by the Mad Scientist FM. Uh, as always, links are down in the description to the database and his Twitter page and everything else. Uh, right, we start on the clubs in England set to release youth players. Just some of the big names. I mean, there's Danny Simpson there. James Young husband, I remember his name. Uh, Mika Richards is also there. I mean, as you can see, these are all real, real youngsters. Uh, Mika Richards is only 15 years old. Obviously, at Aston Villa, uh, for real, at the moment. Wish he wasn't. Uh, Danny Simpson there as well. I mean, he's a young lad. Uh, James Hunt, Young husband as well, 17-year-old. And uh, some of these, I mean, I remember do playing. Joe Tin as well. I'm sure I remember seeing him play. Um before as well but some names that we do recognize in this maybe some names we don't competition wise obviously after the last game we had a great win against Bolton 2-1 playing Charlton today uh, we beat them 1-0 not long ago if we go back to the schedule you'll see we beat them 1-0 only two games ago in the FA Cup so a win here as well would be absolutely fantastic and do wonders for us we'll have to see how we get on uh, reasonably going to be the same sort of team that we put out uh, one or two little changes as uh i'm just gonna camera and camera maybe no camera we'll put camera on instead actually uh i think is that anything is that what we want to do just want to double check that i'm not doing anything wrong no i think we're happy with that there um yeah, we're happy with that. So we're going to have, it's going to be Robinson, Clement, Gamera, Robert Jr., Kelly, Johnson, Kagunis, Bake, and uh, Obi, 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 M I don't know how to say that name, uh, Guerrero and Chapus up front for us. We've just, uh, Guerrero's back now. He's uh, not completely match fit. We can bring on Smith later on for him or something like that. But I just feel he's a little bit better. Uh, player for us and he's in better form and that sort of stuff so it'd be really good I mean if we can get another win here this would be absolutely fantastic for us going up against a good uh, Charlton side they've got Pablo Di Canio I mean they've got Jensen Scott Parker I mean that must be a young Scott Parker 23 years old uh, there Konchelskis um, who else have they got they've got some decent names in there anyway as you can see so really it's going to be a good game uh, some good players it's going to be a tough one but a game I feel we can beat uh, Decanio we do want to make sure that your weak foot is uh, we'll press it intently on you weak foot the wingers as well I always like to do that and we will give them a talk passionately what can we say the media have been on your backs it's gone down reasonably well we'll hand it over to the assistant he's helped out a little bit tunnel wise um, we look good in training that's all we can say and while the game starts guys remember that if you haven't subscribed to me yet hit that subscribe button it would do brilliantly for me please I would absolutely love it as I just noise uh, but I'd love it if you would subscribe if you haven't already and remember to hit that like button as well uh, it would do me do wonders I'd love it actually as I'm going for 250 by the end of April if possible so yeah on help a fellow out a little bit 26 minutes gone 30 minutes gone and not much really happening we are the better side overall as you can see we're having the ch uh, shots no real highlights so 35 minutes in finally get a highlight and hopefully it will be towards us it is it looks like at the moment we have the ball Guerrero now gives it out to Clement Clement comes in puts a cross in it doesn't really go anywhere Bates gonna collect it gives it to Guerrero who knocks it out to Johnson Johnson's got a bit of room but it doesn't really do much with it Kagunis now with the ball gives it to Kelly Kelly to Kagunis to Guerrero, Bake with a bit of room, takes a shot and it's just ricocheting everywhere. Chappers with the chance, get in there, 1-0. Cyril with the goal, get in there my son. That is what we wanted, that is what we needed. Absolutely bloody fantastic. Couldn't have asked for much more than that. 36 minutes in and we finally do get the goal. Took a couple of efforts but we finally get there. A good header and straight past the keeper. That is huge. If we can beat Charlton, this is absolutely huge for us. As you can see, it would put us Bolton and Wolves seven points. This is actually a game in hand, it looks like, as well. So this is huge. We've got to win this game. We need to win this game. Team Talk, what can we say apart from passionately? I'm happy performance keep it up. Not done much. But if we can carry this on, even get another goal or two, it would be absolutely fantastic for us. We so need to win this game at the moment. It's absolutely crazy. Um, 
it will put some pressure on there as we start to catch these two teams up as well. Wolves and Bolton are the two teams we're really looking to catch up. Even Charlton, if they have a particularly bad set, as they come now with Charlton with the ball. Jensen with the ball, what's he going to do? Gives it to Stewart, who knocks it forward. Cole's going to get there. Cole can get a shot off, but unfortunately he can't put it in the back of the net. And it's a corner to Charlton as they now to Canio with the corner puts it in. Can we clear it? We can't. We do just about clear it. Just oh my god, we just about cleared that. Right, we're going to pause it. Let's have a look at our substitutions quickly. Bake's looking a bit tired. Apart from that, we're not doing too bad. Uh, we'll give Bake a little bit more. We'll bring on Morris for him very, very soon. The only other thing I wanted to have a quick little look at was the tactics and the opposition tactics because I feel like we just need to be a bit careful here Colton Co got Colton Coles on there now so weaker foot you pressing intently on you um, and hard tackling in fact yeah we'll do that I think that should do there um, and let's confirm those changes and carry on with the game Give it another few minutes, then we're going to make a couple more changes. Like I said, uh, we're getting to 70 minutes now. We've got a ch oh no, it's uh, Charlton with a chance. We do clear the ball, and it goes out. Birmingham tuning up against Bolton as well, which is crazy. Uh, Charlton have given us so much hassle now. Cole with the ball, we do sort of knock it out. Jensen though gets it back out to Cole. Cole gets a cross in. We clear it only as far as Rufus Diakano can get another cross in here, maybe. But we do block the shot, and it's a throw in. We're going to pause it. We're going to make a few substitutions. Uh, Bake's going to come off. We're going to bring on Morris for you. Uh, Johnson's not playing great, so we're going to bring on Milner as well. And we'll leave it at that. Uh, play. That's all we want to do now. Don't tell me this is the one that goes over. It didn't go over the line, as you can see. I've never seen one of these go over the line. I don't really know why they show it, to be honest. All right, cautious. We're going to go defensive. Um, pause it we're going to time waste as well tactics wise uh is it in this one time wasting uh whenever time wasting frequently we'll do that for now is there any other sort of fitness things we want to do just for now i don't think there is we haven't really got the players to do anything else here uh guerrero can come off actually we'll bring smith on for you if it will let me do it where's smith smith there we'll bring smith up front Give them a different option and maybe a little bit of something to uh, worry about as well. Uh, confirm changes, play. Can we see out the last 14 15 minutes of the game? It's pretty close. Charlton have been the better team in the second half. We might have a chance here though. Clement puts the ball in. Unfortunately, we just couldn't quite get there. It was going to be a little cheeky dink almost over the wall as they put the ball out. Clement should collect this quite comfortably. He does. And he puts a long ball, but it's not going to get to anyone. Kanchelskis is going to get there. Row it now with the ball. Row it even uh, with the ball. We're doing quite well. We're keeping them sort of uh, humbled at the moment. But they do find a little bit of room. And they can come forward now. Don't tell me they're going to try and get a goal. De Canio gives it out to Jensen. But Milner with a great ball. As Serial with the ball. Can he get a shot off? He does. It's not to anyone. Smith can't get there either. And with five minutes left to go, we've got a chance. Clements now puts the ball in and unfortunately just couldn't get it. We're going to have a throw in. We're wasting time. 84 minutes gone. Uh, five minutes left to go. And it's us on the attack, which is absolutely fantastic. Can we get across him? We can't. we got a corner, though. This is good. We're putting the pressure on them. Not letting them have a chance at our goal is perfect at the moment. As we get the corner in, what are we going to do here? Cargunis, can he get a decent corner in? He puts it in right near to them. Um, unfortunately, Brock Jr. is going to get there, though. So we've got a little bit of room. 86 minutes. Now it's a chance for them. It's not really working out too well for us. Parker gets it to Jensen. Jensen with a chance, and he puts it over. And that might have been the, the chance that they they needed to take to really get something from this game we could win it 1-0 there's 5 seconds left 7 seconds left something like that Morris now with the ball what's he going to do just clear it up the lines or something waste time Milner to Morris back to Kelly to Milner again and we'll just come on just blow the whistle ref come on blow the bloody whistle Kelly just launch it up for the field uh, Cyril's going to get there and surely come on that is time we're 30 seconds over time we've got maybe a little bit of chance here we can maybe even get a goal it isn't it is we win it 1-0 absolutely bloody fantastic absolutely brilliant Charlton did take us right to the wire though and uh, made it well we're going to say well done we won the game we need to keep morale up as best as possible 
seven points in it now seven points in it this that's huge seven points in it we we could do this we really could do this i can't ask oh, if we can it'd be absolutely fantastic uh right let's have a quick look look at the league again seven points in it and i think we still gotta play leicester we might have to play but we gotta play birmingham Let's actually have a look, see. Alright, so we've got to play so we've got Southampton next in the semi final. Then we've got Portsmouth. Then we've got Man, you've got Leicester, but um, Leicester and Birmingham are the two. So Portsmouth, Leicester and Birmingham are the three games that we could possibly win. Portsmouth in twelfth, we could win that definitely. Birmingham one below us, we need to win that degree to stop them. And then obviously, um who was the other one? I can't remember. It was Leicester, Birmingham, and Portsmouth, weren't it? Yeah. So we've got a good chance with Leicester as well. We have really got a chance to get nine more points. It depends on what Wolves and Bolton do. It's a close one. It's a really close one. Please do come back for the next episodes because I think this might go right down to the wire, especially if we can pinch a point or two from one or two other games. Thank you for watching, guys. Remember to like, subscribe, all of that sort of stuff. Come and follow me on Twitter as well. Um, and, yeah. I will see you on the next episode. It's been a pleasure as always. Bye for now.